Hey guys, welcome. This is Darren and Leah Miller with the Miller team at Keller Williams in Huntsville, Alabama, and we are coming to you with a new listing. Oh yeah, this one's great. 3218 Stonewall Road. Uh, just a gorgeous street. Uh, I love this street. All, uh, lots of custom built homes. Uh, and this one, this one is also beautiful as well. Look at that front little balcony. I love the way that the front of the house curves, like the, the gable curves, yes. it's so much character. And you know I love a friend's entrance. This is like the ultimate friend's entrance. This is yeah. awesome. Right there, um, it goes into a sunroom or a playroom. We'll show you in just a minute. Yeah, um, in the backyard, take a look at that. Uh, it's nice and roomy. You got plenty of room to do things. It's, it's, you know, it's private. It's got some trees back there to actually block off. Uh, the, the back door neighbors uh, so it's yeah very it feels very private it really door. does yeah. it's amazing um, how how private it is when you have those grown trees yeah it's so, awesome um, all right so let's to, go in get to step in and first of all first thing I notice is the double doors on the mm -hmm. front that are yeah. just gorgeous love a double door yeah. um, it just provides this really grand entrance. Um, this home has hardwoods throughout the main living area. Um, you've got a dining room and a pretty substantial office um, across the way. Yep. Um, really, really nice. Um, this is a custom home um, and you can tell. it's It's got lots of extra features. Um, notice the crown molding, the, um, the, the different intricacies with the hardwoods, yeah. the, the windows. You can tell that this um, this home was very thought out. Um, it lives way bigger than it actually is. Yeah. Um, and it's, it's a pretty special home. It does flow well. The um, That front office space was what the previous owners, the sellers actually used it as, uh, has a cathedral style ceiling, which is great. The stair staircase is very grand, uh, looking into the main living space. Uh, and really does provide a beautiful setting. Uh, you've got the built-ins right there. Uh, a lot of perks to this house. Yeah, I love the high ceilings in the family room. It makes yep. it feel very big. Yep. Um, and this kitchen, wow, it is grand. It really is. You've got a Wolf um, gas stove top, which is so nice, double ovens. Um, you've got the extra prep island and just the space in this yeah. kitchen is really big. Yeah, this is awesome for like an eat-in area, a space to put a table right here close to the kitchen. It's fantastic and, and look at that this space room. right there. This yeah. room is so cool, like it could be so many things. It comes yeah. in from the friend's entrance, so it could be a mud room, it could be exercise room. I had a friend that said that she would like, that would totally be her mom office. Um, it could be um, it could be a playroom. There are so many different things that you could do with yeah. that um, area, or it could just be a place for you to go and have yeah. coffee in the morning. Yeah, um, I think that's probably what we would do. With probably it. a sitting space. <laughs> yeah, is probably would it be for us? I would say. Uh, so looking into the right side of the house, you can see there's the half bath uh, for use for everybody, all the guests and everything. And here's the the owner's suite. Uh, and this room is really big. Yeah, it's and high. It's very nice. You got the tray ceiling. Um, this house all new carpet throughout the home um, and you've had all the walls and the baseboards painted which is so nice so it's fresh move-in ready it is um, really good space in this uh, primary bath as well yeah it's got a uh, separate vanities uh, which is very convenient there's one there and there's your tub and uh, behind that closet I'll show you in a minute is uh, the toilet and then a closet and then there's your other vanity as well I'm thinking this might yeah that's a smaller vanity there so that yeah. would be my vanity probably, probably. But that's, I mean, yeah, you don't have as many tools I have less I equipment <laughs> you know. so yeah you got your toilet closet this has two closets as well so one's a little bit bigger than the other I went ahead um, and opened these up because I really like to show these uh, because there is some space yeah and I love a closet with a window always like I get dressed in my closets in the morning and so um, having that natural light is really nice. Yeah. And there's um, the other closet as well. Yeah. It's still a substantial closet. It yes, really is. It um, is. So Bigger than the one I have now. You can Definitely. choose who gets who, who gets which yeah. closet. <laughs> so this bedroom also looks out to the backyard. Um, again, really private because of all of the mature trees that you have. Yeah, I love that about this neighborhood and about this lot. So we're going to cruise back out here and back into the main space there's your uh, linen closet and uh, we're going to take this to over to this side which is really cool because it's a whole other suite on this side and check this out on the right this door which i believe i might open but that goes into the friend's entrance we'll get to that in a second 
So here's another uh, guest bedroom that is a full suite. Yeah, oh, look at me down. I'm walking the front street. Did you see me there? No, I did not see you out there. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is a guest suite. It's a main level guest suite with a, um, with a full bath. Love that. Let me tell you, this is such a nice feature. Yes. Um, it could be a second office if you don't need that guest suite, but um, you know, with aging parents or, or people coming in from out of town, which so many people in Huntsville aren't really from here, yeah. um, having a, an isolated guest suite with its own bath is closet too. Priceless. And yeah, it's got a huge walk-in you, closet. You could set up like one of those little suitcase holders in that closet for guests. Yes. So it's really cool. And here's the laundry. Nice laundry. There. Yeah, it's great. At the end of this hall, out of the way, nobody's going to see it. Uh, it's really, really great. You don't have to pass it. Like when you come park your car in your garage, you don't have to walk by the laundry. Yeah. Like, that's awesome. Yeah. It's great. And there you go to the guest entrance as well. Yeah. So they could come in through that that sunroom area or they could come in down this hallway um, and throw their stuff in the laundry room. Um, so great. It's just a really cool plan. Love the plan. Love it. Another so That right there is a pantry. Oh, that's right. It's a pantry. Um, and then there's another pantry in the kitchen as well. So you've yeah. got plenty of storage on top of all of those cabinets. Okay, that's, yeah. So another look into the main space there. We're going to go upstairs and take a look. Also that entryway right there is a two-story foyer. It's so uh, pretty. Nice big. So we'll take a look up here, and uh, and seriously, the upstairs is just, it's spotless. It is so good. Yeah, it's pretty nice too. So you've got three bedrooms, two baths, and a bonus space upstairs. Yeah. So I love this bedroom. Look at this, it's, it's like a so Juliet sweet. Yeah, <laughs> you've got the, um, the balcony out there. You can lock that if you need to, but how sweet um, to be able to have um, just an overlook. There are two sconces on either side of that those French doors as well so that you can turn on, turn off. Uh, it's just really cute. Uh, yeah, very I could see like opening this up when it's cool at night and um, letting the breeze come in. That could be really neat. Yeah, that one night a year in Alabama when well, it's... Well, it happens. It totally <laughs> happens. Um, really good size bath with a double sink here. Um, just really, really good space um, for this whole bathroom yeah um, and then we're gonna go right over here to the other bedrooms good size bedrooms they up are, here they are and and one thing that, that we don't see on this video is that this closet that closet right there runs deep uh, all the way behind that bathroom so it is a deep closet with lots of space in there all of these rooms have walk-in closets and which this is, hallway is just you know oh yeah so you could totally big. put like uh, desks for homework and yes. stuff like that you all build, along that hallway. You build it in if you wanted to. Another bedroom here mirrors the other one. Yeah, again, great um, closets, all new carpet, all painted. Yeah. Um, so it's ready to go. Yeah, no yeah. holes in the walls. No holes in the walls. Nice. Right. Fresh. Fresh. And look at this, like another bathroom. And another bath. So yeah, this is another great bathroom. Um, it services the bedrooms and this bonus room that we are about to show you. Yeah, and this is cool. This is a bonus, but it's like a double bonus because it does have a sink and a dishwasher and a microwave right here. Right. Here. Lots of popcorn has probably been popped in that microwave. Yes. Um, you have a really good space. That is a that fits a humongous TV, <laughs> like humongous. Um, and you've got an extra space. If you wanted to put a little um, music area over there, or like even just like an exercise, maybe a treadmill or something, there would be space for that. But then there's plenty of space for a big couch yeah. um, to make this your media room, your bonus room. That spot um, right there is a perfect space for a drum kit. Like it it really is. Right I'm serious. Yes. And you could close it off. It's way far away from everything it's else the, in the house. It's over the garage. Yeah. And so you're not going to hear it. It's just yeah, I great. love this bonus space um, in this home. It it just so makes good. it it like it's just like the cherry on top to a floor yeah. plan that's already really spectacular. Fantastic. So we're gonna walk back down. You can see the the view from up here, and it really is pretty. That is a pretty space. I do. I love the hardwoods. Um, the built-ins are super fun as well. Um, you could. You could decorate them, put books, lots of fun things. Um, yeah. This house also has a three car garage that yes. is fantastic. Um, and if your kids are in sport, into sports, there are some cubbies already built in in, the, in there for all of their sports equipment. So yeah. uh, the sellers were so generous to leave those. And so um, we don't get to see that in the video, I don't think, no. but it's, no. 
it's uh, pretty amazing. So you'll have to come see it in person. But see that backyard, you can see the, the trees back there are just beautiful. Yeah, there's, I mean, it's very, very private. You really don't see the people behind you. Um, and, and you've got the big mature trees over there as well. It does um, come with a tankless water heater nice, as well. Yeah. And the garage um, and uh, lots of room in there. Yeah. This house is to me, one of the most functional floor plans that we have ever sold. I love the way that this house flows. Um, like I said, it lives way bigger than it yeah, actually is. It does. Um, and it's got a lot of character because it's that custom, you know, you can definitely tell it's custom. And like I said before, like we love this street. Um, Stonewall is in, uh, in 12 stones. Um, the homes are all custom built on the street. Um, just really, really lovely. Um, and it is in the Hampton um, Cove neighborhood. It comes with a Hampton House membership, which is phenomenal. You get the pool, the gym, um, the community room, um, and just, uh, just the general loveliness of the Hampton Cove Hampton House. So Stonewall Road 3218, we would love to show you this in person so you could get to experience it for yourself. It's a real treat. Uh, so give us a call, we'll show it to you. And uh, again, some drone footage. Uh, not always that we get drone footage of the side of the house, but uh, but it's just- It's so cool. Very cool, so enjoy. Yeah. Give us a call if you wanted to go take a look.